Now, as the 2019 general elections draw near, there is a call for youths to be more involved in the political space and to be the major focus of all governments in Nigeria. I was at a seminar in Lagos earlier in the day where the Ambassador of the United States of America to Nigeria and other speakers chart the youths for the future. The current number of youths in Africa is over 300 million strong, and this population must be tapped into for the continent to develop into global giants. This was the resolution of speakers at the 2018 Hubert Humphrey Anno Seminar held in Lagos. But the guest speaker at the seminar called for youths to take their position as nation builders and demand action plans to help improve the living standard across the country. Transformation event happen, I mean, cannot happen without a transformation process, without a change program, strategy and a transition plan. But the familiar narrative of the Nigeria issue is that Nigeria is not short of vision, plans, and ideas. But the devil resides in the execution of such plans and ideas and the discipline of the leadership class in Nigeria. In his remarks, the ambassador of the USA to Nigeria called for unity in diversity even during the elections. I know that Nigeria has tens of millions of the most brilliant people in the world. The smartest, hardest working, most resilient, warmest, most wonderful people in the world. The reason that Nigeria can transform the world is youth. You, you who are gathered here. But how can you do it? All right, leadership time to stand up. You don't all have to support a candidate, but when somebody says, have you paid your taxes and done the other things that citizens have to do, you got to stand up. It's less than 92 days to the general elections and observers are calling on youths to seize the opportunity to make a statement.